Okay, I'm here at Big Wave Bay and I made a friend. Introduce you yourself. <laughs> I'm CJ, CJ Trotter. I'm from uh, Sacramento, California. I've been living in China for about six years and I'm visiting Hong Kong uh, <laughs> to do my visa. And he's Doyen famous, apparently. Yeah, Doyen. If you have Doyen Chinese TikTok, you can find me. <laughs> I'm going to find the video and I'm going to put it. <laughs> <laughs> Put in a link. Yeah. For sure, you, you'll get some laughs out of it, for sure. Okay, it is the last day in Hong Kong, day 10. And I am hiking the Dragon's Back Trail. It's on the east side of Hong Kong Island. I took two train rides and a bus ride here. It's quite far from where we're staying in Chunwan. So it took me a long time to get here. But apparently this is one of the most famous hikes in Hong Kong. Wow, I'm going up some steps right now. <sighs> Hold on. I was either going to do this trail or the Lion's Rock Trail. But I decided to go for this one because this one's like much more remote. The Lion's Rock one is kind of in the middle of the city and the view is like of the skyline and I've already seen that so I wasn't that excited about doing that. But this one's really far away. There's like not very many people. There's like a couple people I saw starting the trail. But much less, I think, than the Lion's Rock. Wow. Was filming this while I was walking a good idea? I don't know. I just met a really nice family on this hike. Um, I met them at Sheko Peak and I walked with them back down the mountain. They were super nice. Um, I talked to the dad a long time about American politics and a bunch of other things, but they're from Vancouver and his daughter and um, his now son-in-law, they were here for a wedding because the son-in-law is actually um, from Hong Kong. Um, so that was really nice. You know, one of the things I always try to do on these trips is like meet someone new, make a friend, you know, so I can, um, you know, hit them up if I'm ever in their area. So now I have a reason to go to Vancouver or Seattle because the uh, son lives there. But yes, I love encountering just people on the way and making friends, took a picture, and now I have new friends. <laughs>
at Big Wave Bay and I made a friend. Introduce you yourself. <laughs> I'm CJ, CJ Charter. I'm from uh, Sacramento, California. I've been living in China for about six years and I'm visiting Hong Kong uh, <laughs> to do my visa. And he's Doyen famous, apparently. Yeah, Doyen. If you have Doyen Chinese TikTok, you can find me. <laughs> I'm gonna find the video and I'm gonna put it. <laughs> <laughs> Put it in the link. Yeah. For sure, you, you'll get some laughs out of it, for sure. He's a professional <laughs> basketball player. We were hiking down um, from, like, Dragon's Back, and his legs are so long, I was, like, running. She's being modest. She was walking really fast and leaving me behind. That is the really athlete. true. She left the athlete behind. That's really <laughs> true. <laughs> um, but it was super nice to meet you, and thanks for hanging out with me. Thank you. Pleasure. very tired though, my legs kind of hurt and I feel very s dirty and kind of sweaty still. <laughs> Just really briefly, I want to talk about like Asia's mall game. Like malls in Asia I feel like are like huge and have so many things and I kind of wish America had malls like this. I think the mall scene in the States are kind it's kind of dying I feel like. People don't go to the mall that often but malls around here, like not just here in Hong Kong, but in China and also in the Philippines when I went, like they're just like hubs, hubs of things, like you can find anything here, shops, restaurants, even like get your hair cut. Anyway, I'm actually pretty tired. Like I hiked for almost four hours today, so I'm gonna have some dinner, go home, pack, and then tomorrow's back to Chicago. Dad, how do you feel about going home? We're on the plane, we're about to fly back to Chicago. It's gonna be another 14, 15 hour flight. That is a adjustment for me. But I'm looking forward to seeing mom. Mom. I really don't feel <laughs> I don't feel like I'm at peace without mom actually. <laughs> That's very nice. <laughs> um, how would you rate this trip, Dad? <laughs> is it a good trip? It's a very good trip. The airline uh, is offering some excellent service and assistance for me. Did so you have a good time? A very good time, yes. What was your favorite thing that you did? Well, I, well being with you and going to those uh, fun places. Being with me? Yeah. I see. Not with Kidman, your brother. No, Kidman is... Uh, I spend time with him. And I think that she will find his wife told me that she believes that I can hear from her mouth. The whole world say that she believes in Jesus. Oh, I didn't know that. So I, now I have to assume that she is safe. So what was your favorite thing? Well, I mean... Uh, Just eating because you love to eat? Of course, food is good. But then uh, the activities uh, like that to the, to the mental island. Yeah. But out of all of those things, which one did you like the most? Uh, I mean, <laughs> I think I like the thing uh, how I like it better because this the scene is good. Yeah, it's, it's really beautiful there. In fact, I saw the most beautiful uh, sunset view on Victoria Peak. Yeah. Now time to go home. <laughs> go home. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys later. <laughs>